Welcome friends to our YouTube channel today's we pick another hot sexy lingeries collection from bikini try on haul playlist so enjoy and keep watching but you are requested to please like share subscribe to our channel and don't forget to comment I don't wanna waste what's left. Okay so first up is the pink kind of dress kind of bodysuit the material is a little bit on the stiff side, but it's actually really stretchy. I was not expecting that when I put it on. So I didn't have to adjust anything. I did adjust, actually did adjust the straps a little bit, but then I just zipped the back and tied the bow. And it's super cute. It's really, really comfortable, form fitting. Okay, and next up we have the cinch dress. I actually am in love with it. So cute. What I didn't know is it has like this little peak here as well. It is slightly on the see-through side because I have blue panties on and you can see them. So that's something to be mindful of, but so cute. I thought it looked a little bit long, but honestly, I didn't adjust anything. It's just the way it was, and it fits perfect. Minus the slightly see-through part. And next up we have the swimsuit. I think it's so insanely adorable. I don't know if I love this off the shoulder straps, but you can't put them up really. Well, I guess you maybe could. I don't know. What do you think? Up, down? They are not removable, so you're kind of stuck with them. But the bottoms are so cute with the little bows and the ruffle. I just think it's really cute, something a little bit different. I'm just unsure about these. And next up we have the eyelet dress. This off the shoulder works much better. I'm finally starting to get a little bit of a tan. The white really pops. It fits perfect. This is literally what I took on my trip. I didn't get a chance to wear it though, but I had every intention of it. Because this is so, so cute. Okay, and next up we have the completely see-through set. This one is really hard to try on. I had to put padding to cover the nipples and then I just threw on a gray G-string because I wasn't sure what I should put underneath of this. This is an outfit that I would have to think through, but it is so cute for summer and I'm loving the color. 
You can see the little rhinestone gem details. I think it definitely needs a different color bottom, like maybe one that matches. I don't know. I just grabbed the gray because I was unsure. Either way, super, super cute. Okay, so I just left this top on real quick while I tried on the mesh leggings. And I also left that gray G-string on because again, I just had it on and I wasn't sure what I would pair underneath with this. But, oh, are they ever cute. They're really, really soft and they fit really, really nice and they've got a good amount of stretch to them. I will definitely be wearing these. And last but not least, the outfit I thought I was gonna like the most. It's hard to get a really good idea because I have to cover up so much because it's so see-through. So again, I just kept on that great G-string. So insanely cute. I'm like obsessed with the little apron. So these still tie on the sides and then it ties in the back. I keep stepping on packaging that I just chucked on for. Again, not the full effect, but still super cute nonetheless. And honestly, I'm actually so surprised. I think that pink cinch dress was my favorite. I thought it would be this set for sure, but I think the dress won me over. Thank you so much to Dolls Co for partnering with me. I always love it when they send me some goodies to try on for you guys. And as always, I will link everything that I'm wearing down below along with Dolls Kill's website and their socials. And then I'll throw mine down there as well. And because I'm coming up on one year on OnlyFans, I will be running a 50% off discount for the month. So if you have been waiting to get on there, go check it out. Now's the time and I will catch you over there in my DMs. Talk to you guys soon.